much early KOs with both of those weapons. So definitely be on the lookout for that. But ultimately here, if you're Meg D and Walshy, I think you come out swinging and you throw them off their game plan early on. Yeah, try to get those early leads. But we'll see how well that works out as we get into game number one. Again, this is the elimination side of the bracket. So losing the set here means you're done for the day. Dude, I mean, look at look at, look at Meg D's health. Two dares from Radish, a Nair from Taffy, and then a Sarah from Taffy. And Meg D is already at orange health. Yeah, Meg D's getting bounced around a little bit. And Val, not exactly low defense. She comes in with low strength, but mm -hmm. she puts more of that strength into her defense. Ooh, another one? He touched. Oh, wow. Uh oh, Talk turn around. About, whoa, 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 what just happened? It's actually Meg D who took out Walshy. There was a Yo, bit of a scramble what? there. And Taffy comes in, swings, hits Meg D off. Radish might be able to finish this. Nice. The Nair to deny nice. the wall touch. Dude, that was so good. Ooh. Oh, whoa. Okay. 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 Wow. Nice. Dude, it is a party on the <laughs> right side of the stage. KO confirm options coming left and right with ground pounds, but blue team curly with a slight advantage. Maybe not, though, because Radish is getting put through the combo cycle. Can they find a way to at least get Radish a weapon here? You know, despite the party on the right side, I don't think Taffy was invited because he's still sitting <laughs> on that first stock. Yeah, Taffy is doing a great job, not only tanking here, but getting out a ton of damage early on. Ooh, offstage oh, opportunity, that was Radish. So clean. He's going for it, but he said disengage. He's actually put some damage on the Taffy. Oh, man. All right, Radish looking oh. for an option. Nice there, but a little bit too late. The combo comes out. Whoa, misses the end sig. That is tough, and Radish just might make them pay. Big Sarah comes out from Walshy into an immediate combo. Oh, my goodness. And it's still oh going. Meg D finishes goodness. it with the down sig and actually ends up taking out Radish with it. Red team starting to mount a lead here. Dude, that was so clean. That was so clean from Walshy there to set up Yo. that. Wow, great, great weapon throw by Taffy there to confirm the KO. Okay, three stocks, three stocks. Still pretty even here, Duke. That was great capitalization from Taffy there. That was Meg D's Nair that actually put Walshy in that awkward spot, and Taffy mm -hmm. took full advantage to finish off the stock. Both players right now for each team on these two stocks. Reds with Meg D and Taffy trying to play so safe right now. Walshy, though, capitalizes on Taffy with the sideline recovery, confirms the KO. Meg D, though, in an offstage battle with Radish. Radish disengages, rotated over to the right side now. Oh, combos are coming. Oh, yeah. okay. Radish opted to just swing on everybody there again, <laughs> yeah. knowing that it's 2v2s. You can do some damage. They do finish off uh -oh. Meg D, and here comes the combo. Uh -oh. oh! The dare hit a little low, and Big Taffy recovery. was not able to hit the side sig. Oh, can they get rid of Walshy stock and put the 2v1 pressure on? Taffy also in the red right now. Radish trying to make the most of their opportunity to get rid of Meg D, but still nothing. But Taffy does force the 2v1. Great gameplay. But can Meg D find a way to overcome this deficit? Meg D gonna try to play it safe. Comes up, hits the side sig. Punish comes out from Radish, but Meg D gets away with it and he Ooh. doesn't have a weapon now. Great rotation though back on stage, but still has not found a way to touch and it doesn't matter. Taffy with the perfect tracking and recovery to confirm the KO and take game number one. Damage relatively even between the two teams, about 1,006 versus 1,070 between the two teams. So that was definitely a close one. There was definitely oh. some opportunities for the red team to come back. <laughs> I just saw the spacing on that, and Radish actually set up that combo into the D-Sig yeah. with the Sair right there. That was nuts, dude. Yeah, I mean, Megni and Walshy looking, uh, I mean, they look pretty good right now, but I think we're definitely seeing the team experience from Radish and Taffy on full display early on. Well, we'll see if uh, Meg D and Walshy's team experience starts to level up as we get mm -hmm. into game number two. Radish and Taffy both getting the initial weapon spawns, and Walshy unfortunately finds a pair of gauntlets, so Meg D and Walshy got to be careful about those same move mm -hmm. options. Yeah, and they, uh, I mean, they're just kind of flying back and forth right now. I don't know if Walsh has touched the ground in ages. Okay, finally gets down, gets a bit of damage starting to roll right now. But uh, I love Radish being on the orb right here, right? We're, we're noticing that Radish is able to maintain a lot of stage control. Just Sairs, recoveries, Nairs, everything is pouring out from Radish right here on this orb. And there's really just not an answer currently from Walsh and Meg D. Yo, I mean, Radish's orb is on a whole other level. You don't mm -hmm. see too many orb players out there, but Radish does it so incredibly well. Taffy with a little bit of team damage, but that's okay. They still Ooh. have the opportunity to get some KOs. That was such a big Sarah right there. Oh, misses the team comp. That's two now. That's two team combos they should have had that would have confirmed KOs, gave them an early lead that they haven't been able to hit. Yeah, just a slight mistiming on both of them. Uh -oh. Taffy with the punish, tough. he'll get the KO. Tough, tough, tough. Yeah, a little, uh, little 
little big gamble right there for, uh, for oh, Walsy. No. And no way. <laughs> Some, I think Raiders is like somebody's going to get hit with this. Yeah. Unfortunately, it ended up being Taffy getting the KO there. A little bit of wires crossed there. Taffy runs into it because, I mean, Radish was charging that up. So that yep. was all on Taffy yep. to not run into it. But either way, stock count is only evened up. Yeah, man. They, wow, they are neck and neck. I'm looking at the uh, the damage output for both teams right now. And it's definitely looking in favor of the blue team here. I'm just, I'm very curious on kind of what Meg D and Walshy's game plan is right now, right? Because they're not really trying to set up combos. And they're, they're, their main priority seems to just kind of force Taffy off the stage. Well, they've been doing a good job of that. But Radish has done a phenomenal, you know, assist man job and popping off and building up damage and taking advantage of the opposition 2v1s. Yeah, he's doing a good job trying to just be there right behind Taffy, make sure that Taffy's options are safe. But he, again, taps Taffy a little bit, and Meg D is going to get away. Make sure oh, he's, oh <laughs> snap. Oh, what? Both no, of them. No way. The game of chicken not Dude, working out. That was so risky, and being able to react with that immediate dare. Oh, my goodness, dude. Calculated, calculated, calculated. Really well done from Radish. Goes for the side sig there, not going to connect, but still oh. finding hit after hit. The team combo Dude. in the air on the Meg D as well. Dude, they're, they're, their chemistry is out of this world, bro. Ooh. Nice recovery right there. Confirms KO. Another one. Okay, so two stock, two stock. Still nice, solid damage advantage, though, for the blue team. Meg D and Walshi, they need to really make sure they make the most of these stocks right now before they get into the dark red. Ooh. What a team combo, though, from the blue team. Immediately putting that threat onto uh, one of the red team members. Ooh. More recoveries come out. Red team's in trouble. Oh, that's it. Yup. Down goes one. Over here on the left side, a weapon throw. And the ground pound connects. And Radish and Taffy are now 2 and 0 oh against Meg D and Walshy. Looking back at these replays here. Oh, dude, look at that, dude. There's the chicken. Wow. And just look at the reaction to use the dare right there. Oh, my goodness. I don't think anything's more satisfying in this game than hitting an orb dare perfectly off stage. <laughs> it, especially when they're so damaged, like, they just get launched. Mm -hmm. Also, I mean, if you rewatch that replay, Taffy's on top watching. You can see he's, like, hovering right at the corner mm -hmm. just in case he needs to scoot down there, either save Radish or hit that ground pound to finish it off. But we're seeing Meg D and Walshy change it up. It's now time for the Roman Reigns from Walshy. Yeah, I mean, they definitely needed something. They 100% they needed something, but I'm not entirely sure... It was Walshy who, who should have made the switch because I feel that Walshy was actually doing really well on that Rayman. It was just more of Meg D on the Val, unable to really maintain a lot of prio on the stage or build up damage with the gauntlet. So maybe there's something, though, that they're seeing here where they feel like they can win the matchup accordingly because they are still kind of doing the 1v1 aspect. Never mind. Ooh. Never mind. Combos are coming out. Meg D. Walshy, they're teaming up now. Yep, they're starting to find more and more follow-ups, getting extra damage. We even saw that end sick from Meg D to tack on more onto the blue team. Side sick connects. Huge. Down light side air. Blue team's just Huge. taking it. Yeah, you know what it is? I think when, it, when it's on this elimination side and your back's against the wall, there's something about being down 0-2 that just makes these players turn up a whole new level. And here we go. This is kind of what we were hoping to expect from these players early on. And it looks like they finally arrived. Yeah, just that pressure cooker starting to heat up. Ooh. And you're seeing red team full on capitalization, <laughs> even what? going in with a chase dodge turnaround and sig. Wow. Oh, that was so clean. Sidelight Sarah Combo? again. Oh, back to back combos with that sidelight Sarah option. Very well played from Taffy and Radish, but still they are a bit behind. Yo, but that down say Radish going for more in the offstage against Walshy. Blue team, they've evened up the stock count and they're starting to get that damage. But look Ooh. at Radish, he's taking a lot. Oh, yeah, Radish. See, Radish is kind of one of those guys where, you know, they dish out a ton of damage, but at the same time, they take a lot of damage because they have very risky Ooh. gameplay. And just like that, tried to commit a little bit too much. And that side sick from the Roman Reigns takes the stock. And we are at three stocks to four stocks. Meanwhile, Taffy in the power play, just putting out the hurts onto the red team, swinging all directions. Red team could get taken out here. You see in one Ooh. go down, Meg D eats a recovery to the feet. Ooh, Hadouken almost hits, Close. also drops the D, so going to be able to connect, but Taffy, Wow, that was like barely still enough to get the yeah. KO right there. I thought they were just disengaging because they wanted to go yeah, on yeah. to Meg D, but instead ended up leading the KO. <laughs> and now, blue team with the advantage. Yeah, I, actually, I have no idea how they just came back. The I think it was Taffy. I think you, you calling out Taffy popping off. I think Taffy. Oh, oh no! The save! I can't believe that, dude. 
That literally, that would have been the 3-0. They would have got that, that would have been the 3-0. And just like that, the red team is coming back with a vengeance, goes for the ground pound. You see Walshy absolutely hauling to the other side of the map, trying to make this a 2v1 opportunity, but Raid is, is sprinting away. Taffy at clean oh. health right now. What a read by Raid is Duke. Good positioning, avoids the side sing. He's trying to stay alive. He knows that if he gets taken uh -oh. out, could be trouble, but Magdi's uh -oh. on the outside. This Blue is team. it. This is it. Their entire stock's on the line. Taffy with the double. Side line, end line, and six there. Big butter, boom. They're out of here. Big 3 0 coming in hot for Taffy and Radish. What a phenomenal performance we have just seen from them two today. A clean 3 0 mm -hmm. coming out from Taffy and Radish, and they are going to continue on in the bracket. Guaranteed top six finish. Yeah, I mean that I mean that was not a fluke. I'm just gonna I'm gonna say it straight up. That was not a fluke at all. It was consistent wins. It was phenomenal and fantastic team combos. I mean, dude, that I'm gonna be real. I have Radish and Taffy in my top three. Okay. I have them in my top three, uh -huh. and there's a reason why I have them in my top three. 